Hello, we are here today with Nira from LNT. And Nira, thank you very much for being with us today. It's my pleasure. May I ask you maybe before we start to introduce yourself and tell us what you do uh, for LNT Hydrocarbon? Yeah, so uh, I am basically, I joined Lyerson Jubro 23 years back and I joined as an engineer. So my background is engineering, but then I moved to digital and now I am part of digital transformation uh, program manager at LNT Hydrocarbon. And uh, our key critical assignment uh, today is to have integrated project management system, what we call it Epsilon. So I am having active participation in rolling it out that program in LNT Hydrocarbon today. Excellent. I understand that virtual twin experience is, has been an important part of how you want to drive program. Can you tell us more about the role of virtual twin experience for integrated program management? Sure. So basically we are fostering collaboration. We are integrating data from engineering, procurement, construction, commissioning across EPC value chain and integrating on a single platform. And that's the main strength of the thought process what we had. And uh, so we are, we are uh, bringing all our uh, transaction systems data on 3D experience platform so that all the stakeholders will have the same understanding. They are sharing the same information about project progress, project completion, uh, budget adherence, HSC compliance, quality, all aspect of project management. Everybody shares the similar view because it is sourcing information from a single truth. So that's how we are integrating the information. And this integration brings a lot of value. I would like to give one example that, uh, okay, uh, today, uh, we have a visibility of what is getting delayed against plan. Say, for example, there are 1820 items which are getting delayed. But how integration helps is it is bringing an insight that which are the three top items which are getting delayed, but it is going to impact the overall project schedule. So it is on critical path and we don't have the float. So teams are focused to concentrate on those three items and focus on that and rest of the items can be taken up later in the queue. So that's the value we are bringing through this integration. Very interesting. So, so using virtual twin as the way to reveal a single source of truth for everyone, uh, and then using that as a trigger for collaborations and making sure collaboration happens on the most important items that has the biggest impact uh, on the project. Exactly. Very interesting. I think that's quite transformative for your industry. Uh, you, you, in my opinion, I have seen your organization be one of the very first to use virtual twin experience to that extent. Uh, and I actually understand that virtual twin experience is now also a critical step on how you're interacting with your own customer. Is that correct? Yeah. So uh, virtual twin, twin experiences is extended on the both the sides towards our suppliers and towards our customers. Our customers also want to see what, how, how, the, what is the health of the project, how we are executing, whether it is as per the expectation and as per the plan or not. So they are also expecting us to utilize advanced project management techniques on virtual twin side where they have integrated information coming directly from the source system to the integration platform so that truth maintains and people don't massage the data before they see the information. So it's, it's a collaboration with customer also Excellent. on that front. That by itself is a big transformation, I would guess. Uh, going from uh, emails and static reports to continuous interactions somehow. Yeah. Can we talk about AI? I understand you, you've you done some very smart implementation along with NetVibes and 3D Experience Platform on AI. Can you tell us a bit more? Uh, yeah, so uh, at LNT Hydrocarbon, we have decades of experience of executing EPC projects. So we have a uh, vast database available, vast data repository available. And uh, using that data, using past data, superimposed on current data or current information every day, real time information what we get. Uh, we are trying to generate the insights which will help us to know the bottlenecks and cascading impacts of those bottlenecks so that which will form a risk tomorrow for us. So we want to identify that upfront and then uh, work on that so that we can de-bottleneck those actions or those uh, situations. 
uh, well before the time for successful delivery to our customers. Very good. The, uh, my boss would say learning from the past to navigate the future, uh, exactly. predicting risks and projects from the past is, I think, is a, a very disruptive way of securing on time, on schedule, on cost uh, exactly. delivery. One last question for you. Um, I understand you embarked this journey with 3D experience platform and virtual twin experience on the cloud. Can you tell us more about why on SaaS and on the cloud? So we started the journey with on-prem solution, but uh, the complexity and the speed what we expected, the complexity of the project what we execute, looking both this aspect, uh, uh, rather there's a system themselves has guide us to move to cloud. And after moving the cloud, we have seen the drastic change in the speed, we access the data, we access the 3D and 3D plus data integration, also the mobility, how people can access the data remotely. Everything has improved uh, substantially. Excellent. Thank you very, very much, uh, Nira, for being with us today and for sharing your experience with 3D Experience Platform on the cloud uh, for project and program management. Yeah, it's my pleasure. And we, we are equally uh, enjoying this exciting journey on 3D Experience Platform. Thank you. Thank you, Nira. Thank you.